There's something that comes over me as this cold weather sets in, as this snow falls down, that brings forth within me a feeling, a desire to be cold, to be harsh. So today, as my classes were canceled and the city kind of shuts down, it gives me a lot of time for introspection. And because of this cold weather and a lot of what's going on in my life, it's caused me to be having a very cold and harsh day. Now, I'm having this beef right now, this argument with the city of Pueblo, with a certain board, uh, the Conservancy District is what they're called in there, inhibiting me from painting a mural that's all about mental health, about peace and love, about meditation, about sharing my teachings with the city. And they just don't think that it's appropriate. They think that my teachings are religious, as where really I'm not religious at all. I'm just an artist and a person that expresses my truth and the things that I've learned over my life. And that's what's most important for me to share in my work and in my life and through these videos and through my paintings and through my installations and my works of art. And for this organization who is completely ignorant on the topic to hold me back, it brings forth with me a feeling, a desire to be really cold and really harsh towards them, which I have been. I've been making posts, somewhat attacking them, not so personal yet, but it might grow. and. In this cold weather, my desire to be more cold and more harsh might grow. I do not know, for I'm an artist. I'm allowed to be emotional. That is how I operate. And for me, that's the beauty of being an artist. Is it's our responsibility to express our truths, to express our feelings. So on these days when I am feeling cold, when I'm feeling harsh, when I'm feeling angry and bitter, it's important for me to express those things because I, for one, don't want to be holding on to them. And also, I want to share them with everybody so that everybody knows that we all go through it, that we all have cold, harsh, and angry, and aggressive times. You know, times that aren't easy. Times that require us to fight a little bit, to get out of our comfort zone, to go out into the cold with our shoes off, with our shirts off, and just bear ourselves and deal with these elements and have that fight. So I make this video today in an effort to share with you what I believe part of my role as an artist is. And part of my role as an artist, part of what I'm required to do or what is uh, needed from me or should be required of me or uh, expected of me is to share my truths, to share the things that I've experienced because I put myself in these situations that sometimes require me to be cold and sometimes require me to feel cold and sometimes require me to act cold. And today's one of those days. Today is one of those days when I need to express my truth about how this government organization, this citywide organization that is really just put together to make sure our city doesn't fall apart, they're trying to dictate what I can and can't say, what all of us as a community can and can't say, even though they don't have any experience with that. That's not what their role is. They're there to make sure that our city doesn't flood. They're not there to make sure that I don't say something offensive to you. In this case, that meditation is a religious practice when really meditation is just exercise for our brains and it's a huge part of my practice. And for me to be uh, prohibited from sharing that with you is just absolutely absurd. So I make this video to share my truth, to share my opinions, my, my, um, my creativity with you all. And so through this video, that's what I intend to do. And I encourage you all to just stand up and use your voice. And those days when you're feeling cold, as long as it's not violent, you're not hurting anybody else, like speak your truth, man. You got something to say to somebody, say it, man, because it's like better than holding onto it. Maybe it's too much and maybe you do need to hold it back. Maybe you don't need to hurt anybody. But maybe you just need to express something that's going on in your life. The thing that's making you cold, like don't hold on to it. It might not be appropriate to start a fight over like what I'm doing in some cases here where I'm basically picking a beef uh, and standing up for myself with this city organization. But you don't have to do that in order for you to express your coldness. But for me, that's what I'm doing. And that's what I'll always do because one of the main things that I will always fight for within my uh, my realm of being an artist is the freedom of speech because without the freedom of speech, I'm not allowed to be an artist. And that's why I'm here. And that's what I'm doing. So watch me be cold. Watch this story develop. Watch me move forward and watch me express myself. And even though I might not get a paint, a picture of a person meditating right away on this wall, because I'm actually stepping away and putting it on a different wall. And I just adjust because I'm an artist and I'm very creative and I'll always figure out a solution to the problem. And then also handle this other problem where this group is inhibiting our freedom of speech. And that is my current issue right now is that this group is not allowing us as a community to express ourselves because they're scared of controversy, because they're scared of facing their truths and they're scared of being judged. But here I am being judged, facing my truths, sharing my truths. All so that we as a community and so this city can grow, so this city can get out of this rut that it's in and so that this city can become a great 
place for all of us where we can express ourselves, where we can be ourselves, and where we can be free to be human beings no matter what shape that takes. Peace.